I am so excited to share this with you guys. Are you ready for the big reveal? Look at this room. So this is a DVC one bedroom villa. My family and I, we got upgraded to this and it's massive in here. Look at this, this is like, this is bigger than an apartment. No, it really is. And the best part of it is we actually do have dishes this time. They aren't fake dishes, they're real dishes. But the funny thing is, is now we don't have soap to wash them. So when we do have real dishes, we don't get our little soap set up. All right, and this, okay, is this the soap? No, that's laundry detergent. This is where you hang your groceries. And if you come over here, should I start this way? Stop being disorganized. This is the kitchen. It's, it's full size microwave. You know what kind of things you could cook in here? Probably a roast turkey. You could literally cook your Thanksgiving turkey in that microwave. Wow. And then, this is the little dining area, and that's the Broyhill that you get. It's obviously got a lot of crystals. These are Tiffany. They were imported from New York City. Very nice, and you can see the pattern that it makes on the ceiling. And then, look at that. Little, oh, ow, I tripped. Little Remy. Look at him, he's making apple pie. Oh, it's so cute. And then on the booth, you got this Oh, it is the Riviera. You can see it's the, the Porta Cochet, and then you got the RR, and then look at how big this fridge is. It's like, like real fridge. And then you can make homemade ice cubes. Oh no, they're not homemade ice cubes here. That's all right, that's all right. The reason that they don't have the soap and stuff is because they, ow! <laughs> that was not a slow release. They have a, a dishwasher for you. I did not use a, what is this? Someone put a dingle hopper in here and it wasn't me because I did not, oh my goodness gracious. Because I did not use one. Okay. This is where they hide the can opener so you can make your toast. Welcome valued guest. And then under here, it's not like beach club and boardwalk because you could just pull it. Oh, this is so Cute. Look at them just sleeping right in the Riviera. Mickey and Pluto. Black and white, just sleeping on the Riviera. Oh, oh wait. That didn't do anything. And then, of course, I want to show you guys how strong I am. And pull it with one arm and show you what's behind here. So it's not like the, the studio because you got Peter Pan now in this one, which I'm kind of sad because I really love the Dalmatians. And then sneaking back there in the little corner, you got chargers. So whatever sucker ends up with this bed, they still can charge their phone. Look at how strong I am. And look at the pillow. Oh my gosh, I love this pillow. I might take this home with me. I was excited to show you hidden Mickeys on the curtain, but they do not have them on this curtain. These are just standard, regular Ashley furniture curtain, cur curtains. Ugh. And then, this is the view. So nice. And look at there's people out there playing chess. They're playing cornhole. Playing whatever that game is down there. No idea. Okay. And then look at the bedroom. Look at that headboard. Look at the little hidden Mickeys up in the corner. And then you got the Aristocats. Fancy, and then I, I, I do wonder, does anybody ever take the wrapper off this or does it always just stay clean? And then Rapunzel pillows. These are the curtains that I was talking about with the RR. I guess there wasn't hidden Mickey's, maybe I'm mistaken. And you got all this space to unpack yourself here. And then this is like one of those like rich people closets when it's not, the light's not on until you open it. Oh, it's blurry. And there, see? You got your pizza box holder. All right, and then this is the bathroom with the tub. I've got to speed this up because it's, it's, it's almost checkout time. And then you got the fine marble. You see that? Yep, and then you got this fine craftsmanship here. And then you got a Broyhill up here with some diamonds in it. 
these are probably imported from Egypt and then I don't really know exactly where all the rest of this stuff is imported from and someone already stole all the soaps and shampoos and conditioners and then no blow dryer there is a blow dryer don't know where it is and then you got the shower with a bench so you can contemplate your life rain head portable you got princess and the frog there's a lot of Disney movies in here honestly they're already knocking they're like get out of here look at that you got a lunchbox, a vacuum cleaner, an iron, and washer and dryer, so you're not spending your vacation smelling, which is great. And then, all right, I just wiped the lens off because it was very foggy, but this is what I really wanted to share with you guys. I sat out here last night, and you can see Tower of Terror, Exhibition Everest, and Epcot Forever happened right here, and it was so awesome. I loved it. And look at, I just, uh, no one's in the adult pool right now. Everybody's having fun, enjoying their lives, living their best vacation lives. And we are about to live our best vacation lives. It is so pretty. I never thought I would be someone that's like, I love the Riviera Resort. Somehow, it happened. We're foggy again. Let's unfog. Didn't work as quick as I wanted to, but love it all right we gotta go i'm wearing haunted mansion ears i was so i was feeling rushed i didn't get to do this oh, we left our poopery behind all right quick one two three. Oh no one no oh, no ah where's the name tag come on we got mike we got zama zama and then we got joe and poopery Goodbye, Riviera One Bedroom Villa. I really enjoyed you. I had so much fun, and I'm sorry that that tour was absolutely horrible. All right, so we went from the Riviera back to the boardwalk, and I didn't plan to film this at all because I just was like, I already filmed this on day one, but I have to show you guys because this room looks a little bit different than our last one. Oh my gosh, you guys, do you remember Last time we had the Mickeys on the Broy Hill. It's got a couple of little bugs in it that we're trying to work out. But all in all, it's beautiful. This is where it changes. Here's the kitchen when you got the can opener for toast. You got your coffee maker to make hot pockets. And this microwave is 10 times smaller than the last microwave. And then is there real dishes? No, but this one comes with paper plates. And then, this one is missing its window pane. All right, and here is where the big difference is. This closet, we did not have at all. So we have a closet instead of like that dresser that was out here. So this room actually has a closet. With, and then, same sink area. But this one has a shower with like subway tile tiles. And obviously, I don't know why I just did that. I don't know why I just did that. But let's check the water pressure we got here. Wow, actually I wasn't expecting that. And I don't think you guys were either. And then this bad boy, instead of it being right here, we actually have a mirror in place of that. The molding still stops there, so I guess that's just a thing. The molding just stops there. And then I have to show you one more thing. Also, see, so remember that gigantic closet dresser thing that was right here? Now it's this little one. I didn't open up the, the trundle, the bed, pull away bed. I will. And this is the most amazing part of all. Look at this view. We're by the Atlantic Dance Hall this time. And we have a balcony that's like open and not closed off. So we were over there the other night and now we're over here. You can see Spaceship Earth, you can see Paris, you can see the beach club, yacht club, friendship boats. We're living our best life out here. And these, very nice, versatile. You can take them to the bedroom and then you can take them from the living room and you can push them all, all the way to the bathroom. <laughs> I 
All right. And look. And you can push your coffee table right to where you're getting ready. So if you want to read One Day at Disney and flip to your three pages while you're going to the bathroom, you can do that. We got Christina, again, no name. This is Jake. And then we got, oh, here's a good one, Francesca. Okay, so we're doing this again. Now we're gonna try this one more time now that I learned how to do it in the last room. Okay. I push this in and I pull down and it's not working again. All right, ready? It's not working. You have to pull. Who is it? Ah! This was worth pulling down. Look at how cute. It's Dumbo and he's just laying there with Timothy and they're both just sleeping. Just sleeping in the grass. And that's, ooh. Ow! <laughs> that hurts so bad. I gotta admit, that was not easy at all. That was kind of heavy and hard to push. We're gonna push our coffee table back to the living room. Oh, oh. There you go, you guys. That was like Hollywood. Like, you know, like how they do like movie sets and nothing's like... Cool, right? Look at this stairway. It looks like when you're in high school. What class do you have, Tiffany? Oh, I have Mr. Butler for math. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, and then Jake. Yeah, he broke up with Alex yesterday in fifth period. And this is where the stairs lead you. That's pretty, actually. Huh. So where the stairway led me out, it was like right where the pathway is to walk to Hollywood Studios and like, right where you could either get the Boa Swan, but I kind of wanted to walk on the boardwalk, so we're gonna do this instead. And our room is, I don't know. It's one of these. I wanted to make the boat, but I wanted to buy a shirt before I make the boat. I made the boat just in time. False alarm, we have to go back in the store because that was the boat for Epcot. Oh wait. Wait, is this the Hollywood Studios boat coming? Okay. Never mind. Not going back in the store. Here comes the Hollywood Studios boat. I think. Yeah, he's coming in hot. I gotta zoom in on this. Look at the little seaweed poops. Ew. But our boat is here. All right, now we got to our friendship boat. We'll I'm here with all of my friends. Boy, I sure hate to be a sucker today that's wearing all black. And my favorite restaurant in all of MGM Studios. We're eating in our little car at the drive-in, and I'm gonna get a milkshake. I just love it, I love it here. It's so cute, like how could you not think this is the cutest thing ever? Look at that popcorn just dancing. And the hot dog was just doing a trick, but I'm like the worst vlogger ever, so. But we got peanut sticks, there it is. Almond Joys doing tightrope walking. And then we got blue milk and red milk doing pole dancing. <laughs> All right, this is the wedge salad and I ordered the blue cheese on the side. I know, what a joke. You already know this isn't mine. So I wasn't thinking and I just started eating and I didn't film it. But this is the turkey croissant sandwich thing. And it had a lot more turkey on it than that, but it was a little bit too much for me. And I added American cheese. I also subbed no tomato, not sub, because I didn't get a sub for it. But it is so good. Now it's definitely not as good as the hot dog burger that they used to have. That thing was so good. The best thing to do after you eat a lot of sci-fi diner is to ride Star Tours because that makes everything better. I just had a mission that I've never had before. It wasn't like the underwater one that I'm always usually ending up getting. This one was one that was like, um, you, we had a space bomb and it exploded. We just did Tower of Terror and it was honestly like the best one ever. It felt like Guardians of the Galaxy. Like I was floating in the air for at least like 18 minutes straight. Hollywood Studios ended up being extremely, extremely hot today. I think I only rode Mickey and, no I didn't ride Mickey and Minnie's. What am I talking about? So anyway, I decided that to get my workout in, I'm going to 
use the gym here. The gym at the Riviera did not have near as much stuff as this one does. Well, now we're going to go do something that I haven't done in years. And we got here just in time because look it. Well, listen and look. All right, so we are all checked into what we're doing tonight, which obviously if we're at the Poly, we're either uh, doing Ohana or what else do they have here to do? Tambu Lounge, Trader Sam's. We're gonna do Ohana and we're gonna get a pineapple drink because we have to. We got it. It has been acquired and we are excited. Let's see. All right, hold on. Let me, see. Let me take its little hat off. Oh my goodness, it's a pineapple full of rum. I think drinking this gives you one full serving of fruits for the day. Kind of like. Yeah, so it's healthy. I'm excited. Best part of the drinks at Disney? They come with little snacks if you can get to them. As I'm waiting for check in time to happen, I was just thinking that. It's kind of like trying to get your boarding pass for Rise of the Resistance, if you think about it. Because you're like, I can check in in like five minutes, and then you go in and it's like two more minutes till we can check in. It's like an exciting thing. And then we also got the alien combustor. So you know how on the way in I said it was like the haunted mansion outside? Look at that, you can't even barely see that castle out there. My, oh my. All right, our friend has finally arrived. He did say it is a river outside. So, I made him this. He went to the bar to get a drink. He's not afraid of spontaneous combustion. All right, so I have acquired a pina colada to put into my pineapple so that and then we had the wings, and I ate a whole entire one. We had sausage, and I ate a whole one. I have nothing to show you for that. I probably ate six pot stickers, honestly. I ate the outer portions of it, and I left the inside of the pot sticker here. And then I didn't have any broccoli. And then I tried some shrimp, and that's the shrimp leftovers. And then I drank my second drink. And now that's where we're at. Oh, I also ate all the rolls, and I dipped it in the butter. Ohana. On this channel, I gave you the best review that anyone has ever done. And I mean that with all my heart. If you like exotic food, Ohana is the place for you and your loved ones this spring. I just realized right now at this moment in time that the music we are hearing is this man making laps around here. He's probably on mile seven right now. I screenshotted him and it was like, Remember that? He was like, what? Like, he was like, that's okay. He's like, oh. <laughs> you remember that? Look at it. He did. Remember? I was at two bars. <laughs> that is the most beautiful, bougie thing I have seen all day long. Besides that, that's about to sneak in here. Oh my goodness, so good. Nothing compares. It's hot. Are you ready? Yeah. This is where our juices, our juices join together. Oh, it's hot. In holy matrimony. Oh, I can't do it cute. That was romantic. Oh, holy matrimony. <laughs> Good. Oh, you really <laughs> put it in my bowl. I didn't think you would really do that. Oh, 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 big things are happening here. You can see the... <laughs> That's enough. 
Here. Sit over here. All right, we're gonna see what we can actually see from up here. Besides rain. Oh, wait, wait, oh, oh, I'm so bad at being a vlogger. I miss all that, but there we go. Why are you shaking? <laughs> Prime footage. Now nobody's gonna know what the finale looks like. <sighs> okay, I feel so full. My stomach is killing me, and I would do anything right now to just go back to the room, take a shower, and just lay down. But I really want to see how caught forever before it's gone forever. Eh, eh. And it would be cool to see like two firework shows in one night. So I drove over here, the speed limit, and then I started jogging to Epcot. And it's raining out, but I don't care. I really want to see this. Wow, it actually turned out to be a really nice night. It's not humid, and it's like the air is clear, and I can breathe, and it's beautiful, and everybody's happy out here laughing. It's so nice. That was rough. I said it was a nice night and everything was great and beautiful until I started doing it after eating all that bread at Ohana. Ohana's. I decided to make this as easy and painless as possible. I didn't want to scour the country for this. So my easy exit is right here. And my lazy spot is right here. Mission aborted. One last look at this for the night. I have to show you guys it at night. I mean, I couldn't have just, look at Spaceship Earth over there. And also, I actually really loved Epcot Forever. It was super duper cute. It was definitely a good replacement. Materialize. And we into both the lights. Bring, bring, bring us out to socialize.